In this video, we will install Anaconda, JupyterLab, and Spider IDE. Then we will write and run Python code in our JupyterLab and Spider IDE. So let's get started. First of all, open your Microsoft Edge, Chrome, or any other browser, and go to Anaconda, start Anaconda download, and you can just click on this button, or let me just click on this page so that we can see how to go to download from website. Now, once anaconda.com is open, as you can see here, as it is open, you will see this page and you can just click on download. And right away, the download will start. As you can see, it is 787 MB. So it will take quite some time. So as you can see here, our anaconda is downloaded. So now you can click on open file or go to the folder where it is downloaded and just double click on it. So once this is open, you will see something like this. Click on next, click on I agree, click on just me or all users now if you click on just me this will only be visible to the user that currently you are logged in as so right now i'm logged in as vijay shrestha so it will only be available for vijay shrestha okay so but if you want it to be available to all the users click on all users right now i'll just install it for me click on next and this is where anaconda will be installed if you want you can change the directory hit next and you can leave all these three options unchecked and click on install so as you can see here it is showing completed now you can click on next click on next again uncheck this and uncheck this also and hit finish all right guys now our anaconda is completely installed now press on windows button and type anaconda so you will see these two things here the so anaconda prompt is using command line and anaconda navigator is using gui so Click on Anaconda Navigator. We will open up command prompt and it will take some time to install and initialize for the first time. So be patient with this. So now you can see Anaconda Navigator is open and it is still processing here. Now you can see a bunch of options here. As you can see, like Jupyter Lab, Notebook, and all this good stuff. Our Anaconda is installed and now we are successfully open in our anaconda navigator in your anaconda navigator you will see a bunch of options to install a bunch of other software to install and open jupyter lab just click on this launch button you will be redirected to your browser and jupyter lab will be opening jupyter lab is open now i had already written this in jupyter lab in your case this will be empty so to create a new jupyter lab notebook just click on this plus here and choose a kernel i will choose python 3 and now here you can run your Python commands as I write print. Run it, hit control and enter. As you can see, now we have run our Python line. And now in Jupyter Lab, you can play around and do amazing Python stuff. To install Spider, you just click on this launch button here and your Spider IDE will be installed and run. I've clicked on launch. As you can see here, it is processing. It will take some time and spider will be open now you can see spider is opening up so our spider is now open you can start the tour but i'll just choose to dismiss it now you will be greeted with a temporary python file and python console now in this console you can directly run commands like a equals to one plus two you can directly run python here and now if i print a and hit enter as you can see 3 is printed so this is python console now this is not a python console this is a python file here i'll have to create a python file let's say hello world and hitting enter will do nothing until we run this file and we have to write a equals to 1 plus 2 and then if we print a so all these things are saved in this temp.py now i can choose to run this by clicking this run file icon here so let's run this now we need to choose or we can create a specific configuration for this file for now i'll just keep this run file with default configuration selected and hit run now, as you can see the file is now run and it is showing hello world in three so this is a python file and this is a python console where you can directly do python stuff if you have any questions let me know in the comments below